what we'll be needing for this is the bag. Um, I have parchment paper, um, my tape, my tape dispenser, a lint roller, and I'm also going to use a uh, padding, like pillow padding. I'm going to insert it into the bag so that I can um, press it really well. To know how big I need to print my transfer for here, my sublimation transfer, my image, I'm going to measure the bag, okay? And I'm going to write them down on here really quick. Okay. I want my design to be in the middle right here. So I'm going to do it like 10 inch, 10 inch in the middle, okay? And on this side, I'm going to do it 9 inch. Let's go to my computer. Here I am in Silhouette Studio. I'm, I'm using the business, business edition, but you can use anyone because we're going to print not cut okay here i am and my width was 10 inch and my height is 9 inch okay i'm going to bring the image in here and then i'm going to see what size paper i'm going to use um i'll go to file and i'm going to merge in the image right in here merge and uh here is one of them it will come in big. I'm going to select it and make it smaller. I'm going to lock it right here. And I'm going to work with this, these, these measurements. Um, I'm at the height. I'm going to put it on 9. Okay. And then enter. And then it's right here. 9. Oh. Look. When I have the height 9. And the width this. So I can fit it on 8.5 by 11. You see that? With 8.5 and here 11. So I'm going to test it and see. Um, but if you want to, if you want it bigger, you can put it on a 13 by 19 because um, it's still safe in the 13 by 19. But it's very close to uh, uh, this paper. So I'm going to use this one uh, because of the image, because of... Uh, the, le the height of the image, the 9 will be here and the, where am I? Yeah, the 9 will be here and over here where I measure 10 inch, the 8.29 will, will be very safe. Okay, I'm going to change my page then. Media size, I'm going to choose 8.5 by 11. Okay, uh, let me put it on the paper like to put it in the center of the paper. Now I'm going to fix my print border. Okay, my print border is perfectly here. But if you click on show print border and you don't see any print border here, you can just come in file, print page setup, and then you can see here size, if it is another size, go and choose the paper size you have here, okay? The media size. Like it is 8.5 by 11 right here. And then you decide in which of your cassettes of your printer you are loading your paper. Uh, mine is loaded in cassette one. And it's portrait orientation. And I'm going to click OK. And I have my print border here. And that means my image is safe. My image is safe right in here. So... Uh, I'll show you how to do a text really quick. Text. I'm go. I go to the text editor. My text is the joy of the Lord is my strength. I'm gonna write down the joy, and then I'm gonna click out and go back of the. I click out and go back. Lord, mm, here back is my click out go back strength okay now i'm going to change this up really quick i'll go here okay for the joy i chose 
geometrical what am i writing geometrical not this geometrical it's a bit though yeah this one the joy the joy for the of the i chose berlin uh, berlin sense yeah this one i chose for the lord i chose rockwell rockwell extra bold this one yep for Esmai, i choose i chose um Bri britannia obligatura i i downloaded from um from the phone.com and for strength i chose the name is copper late yeah copper late gothic okay let me put this together really quick the joy of the lord is my strength let me make strength a little bit okay i'm gonna color them joy i'll put joy in yellow of the i'll put it in brown and lord i'll put it in red it's my i put it in yellow and strength what we need i put it in green okay and now i'm going to assemble assemble them really quick i'm going to select them and go here and align them really quick under each other okay and then i'll go in here and remove the stroke and i'll put it in her hair right in here okay since i measured the the, the image already i i like the size of it i, I don't want to uh, make the the lady's hair smaller to put a uh, text somewhere i'll just put it in her hair and leave everything like that okay i love what i have and and now i'm going to i'm going to save all this i'm going to group all this the hair right here i'm going to the i'm going to group the text right here now i'll go to another page and i'll bring in i'll merge in the other one okay this one she will come in big i will select her select come on get selected lock it right here and for the height i'll put nine two okay and i'll bring her right here so here she is i'll go back to my other one and i'll copy the text copy and i'll try fit her here in her hair okay i think the strength the strength um there's no space for the strength in her face i'm going to bring strength down here and i'll make strength a little bit bigger but i'll still leave it in the image of the lady because i don't want to um, make her smaller strength here and strength 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 let me see something i'm going to put strength in a bolder um font um we use the geometric thingy geo geometric the bold one this one i think i love it okay this is our image so i'm going to print them out and then we're going to press them on the bag so here's my bag i got it from a hobby lobby it's 100 percent polyester so this is what i'm going to sublimate on today and like we measured it and i printed my work out on 8.5 by 11 inch and look at the look at the colors look at the color bold color bold colors and i'm using pui sublimation ink and pui sublimation paper this is the paper i'm using amazing color you will see okay now i'm going to insert my padding this is my pen i got it from amazon i will have the link below 
I use it so that um you know I sublimated the the, the sublimation will be even the image I I don't want to have ghosting on on, my, on this bag so I put the padding in okay and then I'm going to press out the like the moisture I'm going to press out the moisture really quick I'll put some parchment paper on top of it the moisture really quick okay let me loosen up the a bit for a few seconds to get it really flat and even it's like iron it I will be pressing these two on both sides, one on the right and one on the left. Okay. Okay, you see that it's really flat. And one more thing, I'm also using my lint roller. To roll off the lint. Because on white sublimation substrates like this one, um there will be tiny blue and black like lint on it that your eyes don't see but when you roll this over it you will see how many will be on here okay i'm waiting for my machine to heat up and now we press it okay our machine is hot I'm gonna turn her around like this and put her here and tape her down really quick like I eyeball it where it should be on the paper. I'm so excited. You will see how amazing the color will be. Stay tuned. And then I'm going to place my parchment paper over it. Okay. I'm going to press it for 400 degrees for 60 seconds. Okay. Okay. Always use your gloves. Okay, this is the first sight. I don't know where these come from. Okay, let's open it. Ooh, 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 look at the ink release. Look at the ink release. And this is the first sight. This is the first sight. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, look what I'm going to add another piece. I cut myself right there. With a thief of this. And I'll put another piece right here. And I'll put my bag. Okay. And then we're going to sublimate this part. And then we're going to do this one right here. Let me lint roll it really quick. Before I do that. Okay. And then I'm going to place my image right here. It right here okay and then I'm gonna tape it and then we're going to press it I mean 400 for 60 seconds look at the increase look at that Almost everything is on the paper. Oh, and the color is amazing. I'm using this one. You can get it from our website, Pui Sublimation Ink. 
and police have a mission paper. The color is the basic. Woo! And here is our work. Here is our work. Look at it. Look at the color. Oh, I hope you could see it. Look at the color. Look at that. Oh, the color. It's amazing. You could you could have seen it in person. This is our bread. Our amazing bread. Oh, the color is it's like it's blood red. If you, oh, if you could see it in person. If you can, could only see this in person. Oh, you would be shocked. I'm also shocked by the color. And this is our bed. Thank you so much for watching. And this bag, I got it from uh, Hobby Lobby. It's like $2.99. This is not a sponsored uh, 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 video. This is just me doing my thing. Amazing, amazing. And I use police sublimation ink and police sublimation paper. This paper is amazing, amazing, amazing. Thank you so much for watching.